Scott Morrison remains an intriguing, and polarizing, figure on the Liberal Party front bench. Morrison has been described as relentless, ambitious, and hardline, although these labels only give us some clues to his personal politics, and ultimately his political agenda. Morrison entered Parliament in 2007. He has both witnessed close up the leadership instability in the country and been an active participant in it. Within a year of winning the seat of Cook in Sydney's southeastern suburbs, Morrison was quickly promoted to the shadow ministry by Malcolm Turnbull. In 2013, this time under Tony Abbott's leadership, Morrison became immigration minister before being handed the social services portfolio in 2014. Since then, under Turnbull, Morrison has handed down three federal budgets. In part, Morrison's conservative politics are informed by his faith, he has been a long-standing member of the Pentecostal Church. Generally speaking, Morrison is economically liberal and socially conservative. He was just one of ten liberal MPs, alongside Abbott and Barnaby Joyce, to abstain from the same-sex marriage vote. Moreover, he signaled a clear willingness to ensure greater religious freedoms during this debate. Yet, Morrison's faith plays a secondary role to his political antenna. As he once argued, the Bible is not a policy handbook, and I get very worried when people try to treat it like one.